Hi guys, Chef Ricky here. Let's do some pasta today. First, we will mix high protein and low protein flour together in the mixing bowl. Sifted flour gives like the texture and it will be easier to mix with other ingredients. After sifting the flour, you can add in a little bit of salt and 3 numbers of egg. Bring the mixture to the dough mixer and using the hook mixing tool and mix the dough. Mix it until it become a soft dough, a sticky soft dough. Once you get a soft dough, put on top of the kneading table, sprinkle some flour on top of the table and also on top of your dough. So you will start to knead it until it become a smooth surface. Dough will start stick on your hands and your finger and your palm. Never mind, just continue kneading it until you feel the dough is not sticking anymore. Once you get a smooth texture, you ready a cling film to cover it and keep it in the refrigerator for 30 minutes. Once 30 minutes is over, bring the dough to the kneading table, sprinkle some flour and cut your dough into half. Flatten your dough. You can start rolling your dough to a pasta sheet by a thickness of 3mm. If you didn't have any rolling pin, you can do like me, using a round glass bottle to act as a rolling pin. If the pasta sheet is too long, you may cut into half for easier to handle later on. Once you get a desired thickness, you can fold up the pasta sheet to start cutting. Trim off all those uneven angles and you can start cutting evenly. You can cut the size of 4 to 5 mm. Then you can open up the pasta and sprinkle some flour so it won't stick together. There you 
go. A handmade pasta for you and your family and friends. Please subscribe us and like our video. Thank you very much. Hope you enjoy the video.